last night setting up the settings because I wanted to get everything ready before today so I didn't have to worry about it. I realized that yeah. we're playing this without any driver updates or the first like day one patch. <laughs> oh, this <laughs> so, is going to be fun. <laughs> so, yeah. And I like started the game up just to like test the settings, like I said, and I already unlocked an achievement. Um, do we do we go with a mask here? You see this? That's the stupidest fucking shit I've ever seen. <laughs> is... Let's not let's not destroy the immersion before the game's even started, I guess. Alright. Did you know in the original Silent Hill 2? Um there was a fail safe to if you couldn't defeat a boss. Where if you just ran around the arena for five minutes or so, the dog the boss just dies, <laughs> and it's huh. every boss. <laughs> I can think of several games I would have liked that for. That would have made me actually finish Sekiro. All right, I think we got a cutscene here. I'm not sure. hands Hate Nashley Olson in this town. Where? I thought it was going to read the letter. Doesn't he? Doesn't he, like, look out over the vista and then read it? He might. I skipped the cutscene because I didn't want to... I just wanted to fix this out. Things. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I see that town. Silent Hill. You promised you'd take me there again someday. But you never did. Well, I'm alone there now. In our special place. Waiting for you. So far, a much less kind of ominous tone than the beginning of the original. It's like shot for shot, basically the same, but it, the music's a lot calmer. That it's a lot more vivid. The name yeah. The envelope said Mary. I agree. My wife's name. It's ridiculous. Couldn't possibly be true. That's... Mary died of that damn disease three years ago. So then why am I looking for her? Our special place. What could she be? This whole town was our special place. Could Mary really be here? Didn't you just Is say you literally really watched alive? her die? <laughs> The fucked up thing is, is I know so much about the lore of this game that I just want to talk about it 
but then I'm like, nah, if I talk about it, it's going to spoil the whole thing for people who haven't experienced it yet. I was going to say, I've played and beat Silent Hill 2 and Silent Hill 4. I've played Silent Hill 3, but never completed it. And I've played Silent Hill 1, but never completed it. So I, I, I kind of tapped out uh, from uh, <laughs> Downpour and Homecoming because those are pretty terrible. But uh, yeah, okay. By the way, can't that was leave. the that was the achievement I got. I uh, tried to run away, and it said "can't turn back now." Achievement unlocked, and I'm like, "Damn!" <laughs> I'm, I was like, "I'm just like trying to test the settings." <laughs> a, a big portion of my commentary here is going to rely on how unappealing this game looks, but I want everyone to understand it is not the game; it is the incredible amount of loops that I'm going through both the way that Jacob's having to run it and the way that I'm having to watch it because he's having to run it at 1080p, then he's streaming it to me at 720p 30 FPS, and then I am also watching it with up uh, lighting because it's a little dark. Oh, so, does, it not, does it not look good On the stream, it looks fine. On For me personally, it was just a little dark, but it looks fine now. Okay. Zoraki Kenpachi playing Rocket League I don't know who that is. I just met them in Rocket League. <laughs> I love the like the symbolism of this path because it's like a slow descent. Like you're descending into madness as you descend into the fog and like the graveyard over here. I and mean, of course, that's what I do. <laughs> we got this picnic table that overlooks nothing. <laughs> Sometimes that's the best kind of uh, picnic, though, is the kind where you're stranded in a very dense fog in the woods and you're not sure where you are. True. I saw one review of someone who played this game early. Not like a video review, just like a text. And they were like, yeah, they really enhance the combat, but don't take that to mean that they got rid of all the PS2 jank that made combat tense. They just polished it a little. Yeah, that's fair. I I have always had a tendency when I play these games to play on the lower combat difficulty. The puzzles or whatever, but I I'm fine with a challenge if it's something where I'm like improving and leveling up, but in a game an exploration game like this, I I'd rather uh <laughs> there there is one setting that I wanted to see that I didn't look at and it I thought it would be funny or interesting to look at on stream anyway. It is there's like a 90s mode. That's what it said. Did you see 90s. that earlier? Okay. Maybe Would game it be play. under... Reticle visibility? Anything? Uh... Maybe it's under accessibility. We could have chose it to begin with. Oh, uh, okay. I thought it would be here as well i don't i don't know what it does exactly it just just said no oh wait is it here no damn it <laughs> <laughs> whatever it wasn't a big deal i know it, it puts like a filter over the game i think it makes it look like the game is played on a crt oh i gotcha which is cool in itself I'm I'm probably speaking out of turn because I've only played Silent Hill 2 a couple of times he really does not look like the guy from the first game <laughs> okay to be fair the guy from the first game looked like I mean, the polygons the second, well, yeah. and the cool. second game <laughs> yeah. but no you're, you're, you're right I just there's something about I don't know this is not how, how I expected him to look I can see that. A lot of people said that. I think it's okay for like a remake to make them look a little different because obviously it's being made in a new light. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm not too concerned with it. The story seemed like it was the same from all the trailers they showed.
excuse me. <gasps> I'm sorry. I, I was just. Hey, Jesus okay. Christ. I didn't mean to be scary. I'm kind of lost. Lost? Yeah. Looking for Silent Hill. Is this the right way? Um, yeah. You can you introduce me to someone who speaks the language of Chinese? It's hard to see with this fog, but there's only the one road. You can't miss it. Thanks. But... I think you should stay away. This, uh... This town, there's something wrong with it. And it's not just the fog, either. Is it dangerous? Maybe. It's kind of hard to explain, but... I'll be careful. I'm not lying. No, I believe you. It's just... I guess I don't really care if it's dangerous or not. I'm going either way. But why? I'm looking for... Someone. Someone very important to me. Me too. Someone very dead. I'm looking for my mama. Someone I mean, my who mother. is very long gone. So long Please don't ever say mama to me again, ma'am. <laughs> I thought my father and brother were here, but I can't find them either. I'm sorry, it's not your problem. No, I, uh, I hope you find them. Yeah, me too. That was a little anticlimactic, but that's okay. Yeah. I think if you keep bugging her, she's like, what are you doing? <laughs> Go away. Oh. I wish you could just walk up and just kick her. Not even, like, hard, but just kind of walk up and just, like, kick her in the shin. <laughs> there isn't even, a like, a regular melee button, I don't think. Oh, there's a run. Oh, I man, guess. can we tackle her? <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Terry Tate office linebacker style? No. Aw. <laughs> She's immune. <laughs> I wonder She's too powerful. If, because, like, the camera's changed. Like, now it's, like, over the shoulder. I wonder if they've put in any new, like, Easter eggs. In places you wouldn't normally be able to see it. You know what I mean? Maybe. I thought you said there wasn't even an update released yet, so I doubt they added anything new, new. No, I meant, like... Because the original game was like tank. It's like the tank oh, controls oh, and stuff. Oh, okay. No, I see what you're saying now. My bad. Whoops. <laughs> I thought you meant like a difference from the like pre real Never mind. Don't worry about it. No, no, no. Just a, a difference from the original game. That's the only reason why I'm like going wide here. The fact that she's left the town and it's like, the town's a little crazy is kind of like, I don't know, it's interesting. A lot of people think that this, like, Silent Hill is based on Centralia, but the director for the game gets mad if people say that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just, plus, like, Eh, I mean, I guess I can understand. I was going to say it seems kind of silly to get mad about that because there are a lot of similarities. But I mean, I guess if you're just really like, no, it's not what it's about. I, well, I think he gets mad about it because it was the movie that said that, like made that oh, reference. Okay. But yeah. in reality, the fog has become like a crucial part of yeah. Silent Hill. And it was it originated because of the PS2 render distance being terrible. We. He totally could have driven his car down here if he really wanted to. Yeah, but then we wouldn't have all the spooky buildup. I guess that's true. 
I'll let you win this argument. <laughs> <laughs> Hearing some funky noises. Can I go in here? Oh, probably. Oh, and and the non-stop, uh, the non-stop of finding locked doors in a horror game begins now. Went to town to get the window fixed. Spare keys in the drawer. Well, I better find the drawer. Anyone in here? I hope not. This place is a shithole. Dead ass thought that hat mm. stand was a person right there. It's it's not a hat smoke. stand. Dark There's, as hell, a, um, There's a drawer. There's a drawer here. It's gone now. <laughs> Auto parts. There's nothing hidden about it. Cool. So, okay, cool. So, he, it teaches you to leap in the building just to let you get out of it. Oh, wait. There's nothing in there. <laughs> Saw that one coming. It's dark as fuck. Yeah, that's. A, I'm glad I have my brightness on the monitor up a bit. It's gonna to get to a point later in the game where I'm just like, fuck, I need to turn the brightness up, but for right now, I'll deal with it. Oh, 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 God. Auto parts. Can you leap over these? No. That's a that's a visible barrier. No, you can just kind of <laughs> impotently and limply lean against it for a second. <laughs> He just comes to a solid stop. It looks like all the momentum like leaves his body at once. Yeah, but dude, your dead ass could have dri driven all the way down here. You could have just busted through half these doors with a fucking car. <laughs> oh shit. Sorry for everybody watching and listening to me as I knee my fucking desk. <laughs> I didn't hear it through the mic, to be honest. So oh, okay, good. Because I had Discord was here. like, no, it saved us. <laughs> good looking out. This walk is a lot fucking farther than I thought it was. <laughs> I it really does feel like we've been at it for about twenty minutes now. Can we go this way? Nope. Can I open? Nope. <laughs> Good old James here. He doesn't like interacting with much. No, he really doesn't. Or apparently just kind of walking past things. We've arrived at Silent Hill. I think they'll let you do that thing where you can draw on the map yourself. Uh, I don't know. Considering it didn't let me do it just then, uh, I guess not. Huh. But this map is definitely better than the one from the first game, or the second game. That, that is very true. How the fuck? Note to self, you have to hit M to get the map to go down. <laughs> Cannot hit escape. Oh my god, Jacob. Let's go buy her dead wife some flowers. We can buy some dead flowers to go with her. <laughs> exactly. Here, honey. These, these reminded me of you. I swear there was a noise in the game just then. Probably. 
Uh. Well. Cool. Said he'd be back to pick up, but pick him up later. <laughs> okay, Lois. What the fuck? I don't know. It's just what I think of somebody in a small town running a flower shop. They sound like Fran from the nanny. What do you mean? This is, cl this is clearly blood. I, th I think I think James that's what we refer to in the industry as viscera. Viscera. Let's see. Did you know they brought back the same uh, songwriter or whatever? Yeah, yeah, he's awesome. I I love all the Silent Hill music. Very cool to see. There was a um. Ooh, I'm gonna mispronounce the name, and everyone's gonna get mad at me. Um, there was a really good, I believe it was either a Half-Life mod or Gary's mod thing, and it was a Silent Hill, like, short horror game. I don't think the guy ever finished it, but it was like a little fan Silent Hill short first-person horror game uh, that came out a long time ago. And uh, I think it was called, like, Al Alchemia Hospitals, like, named after the hospital in the game. But I don't remember what the hospital is named. Another really great Half-Life mod that kind of died on the vine was uh, Underhouse, I believe it was called. What was that about? Uh, it was kind of a weird... Uh, during the day, you were like in this house. It's like real fucking creep. Oh. Yeah, James, that definitely looked like someone who wants to be your friend. Look at all the blip, the viscera they left for us. He goes more of that stuff. What the fuck do you think this is? If it's in the middle of the road, it's either... It could just be roadkill. You could say it's roadkill. But no, uh, in Underhouse, or what, Underhell? I don't forget what it was called, but... You were a cop and so like during the day you're in this creepy ass house and then at night you had like flashbacks of like being a cop and at first it starts normal but then it starts to get real fucking wild to where you're like in this like abandoned prison it's it's interesting boy i sure hear a lot of noises that don't sound great yeah yeah i don't like this I don't even have my stick yet. What the fuck? Hello? Oh, that's... Why on earth would you still be trying to talk to it? The thing sounded like <laughs> a fucking <laughs> Muppet being flushed down the toilet. Clearly it didn't want to talk, James. I think we should turn back. <laughs> Where did it even go? Oh, it went that way, but like yeah. it looked like it dove into the fence. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, check this shit, power bomb. Check this shit out. Look what I can do. <laughs> Look, Ma, no hands or eyes or teeth. <laughs> we gotta go in there 100%. Yeah. Oh, there's a little Don't like it. Not one bit. I'm gonna be terrible at this combat, by the way. That collapse behind you. <laughs> A glowing red paper. I wonder what that could be. <laughs> well. It's a safe. I love how sometimes James decides to use his hand, and other times he just barrels through it. Nutrition. Oh, shit, you found my vitamins. <laughs> Those aren't cookies. That's just cookie. <laughs> yeah, it's one. It's like the really big ones you get at, like, sub shops. Do you know... 
Do you remember that episode? I don't know if you ever watched Everybody Hates Chris, but they made it that same joke. <laughs> where they get the like the store brand cookies, but it just says cookie. <laughs> I mean, that, that works. It's like when Walmart makes all their uh, knockoffs of like uh, Nabisco products and stuff. How did he even get on that side? Did he climb the cardboard? <laughs> like how even in the cutscene you can see the log he pulls out. <laughs> the board. Stay back. I don't think he plans to do that, James. Oh, fuck. I think that's what you're supposed to dodge. I think he's dead. Stop, yeah, stop, that, he's already dead. That literally almost killed this guy. It literally almost killed him. Oh. It's V to use your stuff. Oh, it's, it's v? v? Yeah. Nice. I wouldn't have saw that. In fact, I didn't see that. <laughs> First aid? Ah. An old needle. Yeah, I was gonna <laughs> say, yes, that's the... Okay, so you press V to use a medical potion, and then you hold V to give yourself tetanus. Love that. Love to see it. Love to see games get progressive like that. <laughs> there you go. Damn, dog. This radio's broke. <laughs> <laughs> if only I had a better radio, I could save my <laughs> wife. I don't think she's gonna hear you, man. I see it. I see it right there. Okay. There you go. I was like, do I open the trunk? What happens here? Yeah, James is more of a of, of, a, of an aggression based uh, door and uh, window opener. Bar Neely's. Ah, uh, uh, yes, you can read it. <laughs> Ooh, it circles. It. Well, that's good. So we gotta go up here. We gotta that go does right. kind of suck, though. I used to love drawing stupid shit up. Excuse the fuck out of me. I don't know where that went. It's right there. Oh, there it is. And there it goes. I understand that was supposed to be scary, but that was pretty fucking funny. He kind of just popped out, knocked something over, and then slithered it away like, Oh, my bad. <laughs> That's my bad. That's my bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's my fault. It just runs. Uh, what the hell? Get the fuck over here. You, where the fuck? I gotta go right anyway. Get away from me. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Fuck. I guess 
Hit him a bunch. What the fuck? The second one was just for me. <laughs> I think it's like a break in the character model, but that looks like some leather straps right there on its ass. I think it, it's kind of funny. Well, I think I think it's in a like a it's in a straight jacket, right? That's like see yeah. I actually think that is its ass. Like I think it's like like a like almost like a onesie. Oh. Uh.